Our group chose the topic terrestrial planets. Terrestrial planets are Earth-like planets made up of rocks or metals with a hard surface, making them different from the other planets that lack a solid surface. Terrestrial planets also have a molten, heavy metal core, few moons, and topological features such as valleys, volcanoes, and craters. In our solar system, there are four terrestrial planets, which also happen to be the four closest to the Sun, Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. During the creation of the solar system, Mercury is the smallest terrestrial planet in the solar system, about a third of the size of Earth. It has a thin atmosphere, which causes it to swing between burning and freezing temperatures. Mercury's thin atmosphere was created by solar wind blasting the surface. Mercury is also a dense planet, composed mostly of iron and nickel with an iron core. Its magnetic field is only about 1% that, that of Earth's. The surface of Mercury has many deep craters and is covered by a thin layer of tiny particle silicates. In 2012, scientists found extensive evidence of organics, the building blocks of life, as well as water, ice, and craters shaded from the sun. Mercury's thin atmosphere and close proximity to the sun make it impossible to host life as we know it. The orbit of Mercury is the most eccentric of the planets in our solar system. The planet has an orbital period of 87,969 days, Earth days. For every two orbits of Mercury around the Sun, it rotates three times on its axis. This is known as a 3 to 2 spin orbit resonance. Venus is often referred to as our sister planet due to the many geophysical similarities that exist between it and Earth. It is about the same size as Earth, has a thick toxic carbon monoxide dominated atmosphere that traps heat making it the hottest planet in the solar system. Much of its surface is marked with volcanoes and deep canyons, the biggest of which is 4,000 miles long. Few spacecraft have ever penetrated Venus's thick atmosphere and survived. And it's not just spacecraft that have trouble getting through the atmosphere. There are few crater impacts on Venus than other planets because only the largest meteors can make it in. Venus is around 300 to 500 years old. Being the hottest in our solar system, it reaches an average on 750 kelvins daily. The surface of the planet does not have many craters, but has a lot of volcanoes. Venus differs from the Earth with temperatures in the sense that it stays the same temperature day and night at the poles or at the equator. Besides the thick atmosphere, this is due to the fact that Venus only tilts on its axis to 3 degrees in any way at the most. Venus orbits the Sun every 225 Earth days. There is roughly two Venu Venusian days per Venusian year. One Venusian day is equivalent to 116.8 Earth, Earth days. The pressure on Venus is 92 times that of Earth's. Its equatorial radius is 2,110 miles, about half the size of Earth. Its age is roughly 4.5 billion years and its density is 3.9 g slash cc. The structure is core is made of iron, nickel, and sulfur. The mantle is made of silicate rock, and the crust is mostly iron-rich basaltic rock similar to Earth. Mars has the largest mountain in the solar system, rising 78,000 feet above the surface. Much of the surface is very old and filled with the craters, but there are ge geologically newer areas of the planet as well. As the Martian poles are polar caps that shrink in size during the Martian spring and summer. Mars is less, dan less dense than Earth and has a smaller magnetic field, which is indicative of a solid core rather than a liquid one. While scientists have found no evidence of life yet, Mars is known to have water and organics, some of the ingredients for living things. Evidence of methane in varying amounts has also been found in some parts of the surface. Methane is produced from both living and non-living processes. The Martian atmosphere is the, true, is the very definition of thin air. Its atmospheric pressure is about 100 times less than Earth's. The main gases for Mars are 96% carbon dioxide, 1.93% argon, 1.89% nitrogen, and 0.145% oxygen. The surface on Mars is a dry, dusty rock surface. The southern half of the planet is much more rugged, with many more craters and highlands. The northern half of Mars has more smooth basins and what appear to be dry lake beds and sinuous river beds. In winter, near the poles, temperatures can get down to 195 degrees Fahrenheit. 
A summer day on Mars may get up to 70 degrees Fahrenheit near the equator, but at night the temperature can plummet to about negative 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Mars's weather, Mars's current climate changes drastically during the year. It has seasons similar to Earth's due to the tilt of its axis. Mars has a rational, rotational period of 24 hours and 37 minutes, one Martian day, and a period for revolution about the sun of 687 days, and that's one Martian year. Because of the small diameter and low mass, the surface gravity on Mars is only 38% the gravity on Earth. If your bathroom scale read 100 kilograms on Earth, it would only read 38 kilograms on Mars. Mars has the largest dust storms in the solar system. They can last for months and cover the entire planet. The seasons are extreme because its elliptical, oval-shaped orbital path around the sun is more elongated than most other planets in the solar system. The Earth is about 3,959 miles round. Its age is 4.5 billion years old and its density is 5.5. Its features include valleys, plateaus, mountains, plains, hills, uh, glaciers, oceans, lakes, and rivers. The structure is the inner core and outer core are made mostly of iron. The mantle is made of silicate rock, and the crust is made of iron, oxygen, silicone, and magnesium. The atmosphere is a mixture of nitrogen at 78%, oxygen at 21%, and other gases at 1% that surround Earth. High above the planet, it, the atmosphere becomes thinner until it gradually reaches space. It is divided into five layers. Most of the weather and clouds are found in the first layer. The temperature. The average Earth temperature is about 61 degrees Fahrenheit, but temperatures vary, great, vary greatly around the world depending on the time of year, ocean and wind currents, and, also, and weather conditions. Summers tend to be warmer and winters colder. Also, temperatures tend to be higher near the equator and lower near the poles. <coughs> seasons. The seasons are a result of the, old, of the Earth's tilt, 23.5 degrees. Contrary to popular belief, the Earth is not a greater distance from the Sun during winter. Actually, the Earth is closer to the Sun during winter. The Orbit of Earth Like all planets in our solar system, the Earth is in an elliptical orbit around our Sun. In Earth's case, its orbit is nearly circular, so that the difference between Earth's farthest points from the Sun and its closest point is very small. It takes roughly 365 days for the Earth to go around the Sun at once. This means that the Earth is rushing through space around the Sun at a rate of about 67,000 miles per hour. The Earth's rotation is gradually slowing. This declaration is happening almost imperceptibly at, proxim at approximately 17 milliseconds per 100 years, although the rate at which it occurs is not perfectly uniform. This has the effect of lengthening our days, but it all happens so slowly that it could be as much as 140 million years before the length of a day will have increased to 25 hours.